Hey, 大家好 my name is Lei. If you are a foreigner and you come to China, you probably will realize that some people like to stare at you. That's a very common phenomenon, uh, especially if you are a white person or black person or even a brown person or green person, person or whatever. And, <clears throat> and so some of uh, Chinese people would just uh, stare at you with a smiling face or some of them might uh, stare at you and standing there just stare at you like this uh, so you might wonder why let me explain to you you see China has 1.4 billion people and most of them spending their entire life in a small village or a small city where they doesn't have too many chances to meet a real foreigner and China is different as uh, and China is different to uh, those countries like the US, Canada or Australia China doesn't have the immigration policies or let's say it's not open to the foreigner to come into China for living or for living a long time but if you are visit here it's fine you can apply for the uh, visitor visa so, okay, just, just let me uh, cross the road first. Let me cross the road first. This is how it goes. So many people at the same time cross the road. Yeah, I think I'm gonna cross the road right now. Because it's green light. But you have to watch out the electronic scooters because they're some of them they don't follow the follow the rules, follow the traffic lights. Also, that's another topic I want to talk, but not today. So I'll talk it another day about the electronic scooters in China, also the rules and uh, you know the safety issues behind the scene. <laughs> so that's how it goes. Uh, the reason why some people want to stare at you is simple. I think because they want to uh, communicate or just talk with you because they are curious, curious about you know just like uh, where you're going or uh, you know how are you, have you, uh, do you use chopsticks, you know just questions like that. But uh, <coughs> and some people they might want to. Um, Hold on, uh, which way should I go? I mean, it's just follow this way. And some, some, of, some of them might uh, just want to take a group photo with you. But that usually turns to be a photo of yourself because they don't, uh, they don't know how to, how to talk, uh, how to talk in your language. Uh, because, you know, most of, most of foreigners in China, they don't speak uh, Chinese. That's, uh, that's why. I will see a lot of Chinese people overseas stare at you. No, right? Because in those countries you are you are not special, and they have also seen enough of uh, you know white people, black people, or brown people, whatever colors it is. Uh, <coughs> so that reminds me a story of mine that uh, when I was in New Zealand, when I uh, when I when I was uh, going to the to the supermarket, the, the countdown. Yeah, yeah, that's why that's the name. Uh, so there, there are always some local people try to you know try to uh, wave at me or say hello to me and I always reply back to them because I think it's very friendly and I think the same logic apply here in China uh, but because you know in China most of people they just speak uh, Chinese and some of them speak uh, Cantonese or uh, you know whatever the local language is that dialect that they have sometimes when you see two Chinese people cannot talk, talk cannot understand each other it's not a big deal because they have their own dialect you know some of you might think stare at someone is rude so do I but I think most of people are friendly and I believe the way stranger treat you is a reflection of your attitude so next time when you see someone stare at you try to wave it back or you know say hello in Chinese to them see what kind of re reaction you will get 
Okay, um, that's it for today. Thanks for watching and have a good one.